Second, I'll design ask your viewers a question and get a response instantly. Welcome back to Brand Locally. With Canvas polls and quizzes, you can now turn simple presentation into interactive experience. Perfect for workshops, content creations, and even live events. This tool takes passive viewers and turns them into an engaged participants. Now let's open up our Canva and let's search for a template that will help us uh, for the quiz them, like this one. Uh, if you already have a script like for the quizzes that you want to distribute to your students, we have a uh, customization, but for now we're going to start exploring the quiz time in Canva itself. So let's find the template that suits us. Okay. The memory game. Let's check each one by one. Okay, this is a memory game. I want something about quizzes. Before we begin. Okay. Oh, what if we search for something about quizzes? Here you go. Dig your game, quiz topic. Write your question here. It's going to take time finding the right. Here you go. I think I like this one. There you go. Let's start to customize this template. We have trivia quiz right here. Now, now uh, later on, we're going to customize the, this one, the pictures around here, the default pictures. But I want to, to show you how polls work in this kind of setup in Canva. So whenever you have a presentation like Okay, which planet is known as the red planet? Blo Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Mercury. Now, they, they are just going to raise their hands. But we currently have a Canva right here. We go to elements and we have polls and quizzes right here. We have here. Now, let's check some. Maybe I want this. We are going to go to quiz. And let's check this one out. Okay. Oh, it was doubled. So what we're going to do is we edit this one. And we delete the header. And the option one will be Venus. Mars. Jupiter. Jupiter and Mercury. Okay, now you can also choose the correct answer. This one, mark as correct, mark as correct. But let me ask you, which planet is known as the red planet? It's Mars. So let's mark, let's mark as correct the Mars. Now what you're going to have to do is we delete this part right here and we put it on this side. Okay, let me check if I did it correct. Okay, we have Mars right here. Now... When someone submitted this, if you send this link to someone, what they're going to do is they're going to answer this one, Mars. And once they submitted, see, it's a correct response. And the good thing about this is you can track the responses. Crystal Medina, Mars, grade, here you go. Timestamp, total. Now, if you want to, if someone guessed it incorrect, let's try to create another one again. Okay, so what is the chemical symbol of gold? Now let's check out the same uh, format. Now let's put it on an edit form. Let's delete this one and AU, AG, PB, FE, and there you go. So let me ask you, what is the chemical symbol for gold? It's, oh, <laughs> it's AU, okay? So let me delete this one right here. Put it here and make sure it is the correct answer. Let's mark this one as correct. But what if the student did not answer the correct answer? Now, what if, for example, they did FE? See, 
it says here incorrect and it will show you the correct answer and when you click responses fe grade incorrect total that's it for more tips like this don't forget to like comment and subscribe i'll see you on my next video bye bye